Hey guys, welcome to another episode. As always, Mr. Big with you guys. Uh, happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Enjoy your family time. Um, eat that turkey. Um, enjoy your dinners. Um, get ready, everybody's busy. I know everybody's um, working and still catching up. And some people have five day weekend or four or three or two or some. I'm gonna work tomorrow morning. I got stuff to do, but be thankful for everything you got. Uh, simple things uh, just be thankful for the Sun you know and uh, um, the weather that we have just uh, random random things like don't take anything for granted just be thankful for everything and um, thank God for everything you have and you will have and your um, you know any you know people in your life Jeremiah's car is actually in primer and um, I wanted to show you guys that it's been kind of getting cold at night so I was only able to work until like three, four with primer or anything like that, any kind of sanding because it's cold and um, it's dark. It gets dark fast. It's like 4.30, um, close to five o'clock, it's already dark. So, uh, and I don't want to do dust. Uh, I don't want to dust uh, up the whole shop. So I'm doing things outside that require dust or spraying or anything like that. Um, or any kind of primer, I'm doing it outside. So um, let's go see what we got on his car. I got my helper over here. Good morning, Noah. Good morning. How you doing, Broski? Good. What's your plan for today? Uh, help Dado. That's a very good answer. Then, what is? What are you thankful for? Um. Thanksgiving's tomorrow, so what are yeah, you thankful for? Um, about my family, about God, and just about how I have a roof over my head. Yeah, I was talking about Thanksgiving. You know how we're supposed to be thankful for everyday life things like you know sunny weather like beautiful weather like today and um for each other and stuff like that so transportation transportation just School. um things yeah things that are regular for you but somebody's we could be somebody's struggle so you always have to be thankful so noah said he's gonna help me today and we're gonna go and uh still work a little on jeremiah's car jeremiah's lexus and right yes sir all right, so we're outside here with this car. Basically, it was like two days of work. This complete bumper got sanded down. You guys saw the prep process. Now it's primered, everything's taken care of. All the, there was a crack right here. I welded it on the other side. I put like a little mash over there, some JB Quick, uh, so it's not coming apart because when you bend it and you handle it, it'll come apart So and fix this. And, so it's primered here, all the spots. There was a bunch of new parts that I found, new spots that th there was, was a dent here, a little scratch there, another ding here, one here. There was, I mean, this was a lot of issues. This car had a lot of dings. I'm sure there's a few things that we're gonna miss, but 99% it's complete. This was already, this ding right here, annoying. Uh, another scratch on top of the mirror, so I had to spray half of the mirror. These doors got uh, primered completely. You can see this, look at this, I'll unmask it because when this tape gets wet or like stays overnight, it gets sticky too. It sticks to the car. The glue comes off the tape and it's not good. So you want to unmask your car when you're done spraying, like 30 minutes later, just unmask it. So you don't have that glue, like, like right here. You'll see, you see that glue right there. That's crazy. This one is still good. It'll still come off. See, it's already tough. This has only been overnight. See, it's coming off kind of hard already as it is, so. Some lines, you don't wanna, when you spray primer, you wanna have like a soft line like this, so it's easier to sand. Um, sometimes you have these straight lines like this, but it's on the edge, so it's easier to sand it on the edge. Like you just go, you just take a new 600 wet and you just sand it extra hard. But usually I spray where it's like this, like a, like a blended um, spray. So it's easier to sand. And uh, these pieces are good. These, these three are good or four. This little one's good. And uh, look at this side. Mirror was damaged as well. Fix that. This door had a ding. This door was, I mean, literally the car all around. Like this came up right here. I found a dent right here. This quarter panel right here is um, all done right there. Um, I fixed it. But this part I did not finish because 
Um, let me open this up because I had to put more Bondo and it was late already in the day. So I have to finish it today and primer it with the other car that I'm gonna be doing. Um, and this is the inside one that the damage that I was talking about in the previous video that nobody wants to deal with. But I mean, I put very minimal of Bondo here, but you gotta go, this is, there's no way to get it out unless you open it up. So I just put a little extra Bondo on here. It's gonna be like a quarter inch, but it's only a small spot. It's only like, what, five, five, six inches, you know? So this is done. Uh, bumper had a scrack right there, a little scratch. Uh, these two pieces are completely primered. These are the trim pieces from the door. I put a bunch of primer in there. This is a little crack, but I filled it up. We'll sand it and it'll be okay. Um, Cause this is the skirt. This is a different color. This is silver silver trim like you see on the bumper right there so the whole car on the bottom is silver and the rest of it is pearl white so yeah that's the update on the jeremiah's car we're gonna send the primer today we got our helper here today hey hey buddy what's up cat hey yeah so that's the story on this lexus no no it was we had fire you guys yesterday and uh we had this fire pit that we made out of wood the tree that fall that fallen and so look how what Noah made it. N Noah did it all. What you got there, Noah? Look, it's the metal can or the metal strings that melted in the fire. It was something from and it the dripped parts. Down. It dripped down. Look, it's frozen in time. Look at this, like a. So well, we it's had pure some metal. Look. Yeah. Or is that aluminum? No. No, this is metal. How did it melt like that? There was some stuff in here that we had an old pile here. Like aluminum, look at that. Aluminum can is still there, look. Not melted. Look, it's still smoking over here, don't you see? I know, it? yeah. Right here. We had, the fire was going all night. So we created our where little should, where fire. Where should I put it? Because I kind of like. Just keep it. It looks cool. Look, it looks like a should knife. Should we clean bro. it? Should we clean it? No, just like this. You know what it looks like? It looks like the liquid you pour in to make weapons and stuff. I know. It's probably some kind of. It's mixed. I think it's mixed. I think it was like a probably metal and aluminum. Some yeah, some kind of mixed metal because it melted pretty good. Make a make a make a sword out of it. Sword. You gonna have a sword, bro? <laughs> yeah. Dude, that's sick. Yeah, we had a little fire going last night. Look, we and had. Then when you, and then you when you put it back in the same spot, it looks like it's still there. Oh, it was right here. Yeah, it was exactly. Oh, so it leaked oh, out. Okay. Yeah, look, see, look at the burnt part. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I see, I see. So it leaked out all the way here. Yeah. Okay. We didn't see it last night. Make sure there's nothing here. No, no, it's fine. That's already. See how like the wires are not melted, but yeah. this was some kind of like a radiator piece that we threw in. Uh, but it looks cool. It's like. Because we burnt some. Metal. Yeah, we burnt some stuff here. That is cool, I'll, man. I'll keep it. I'll... You wanted something to do while I'm doing a car? No, um, I, I didn't. Listen, what you did yesterday, I have, I'll have. i tell you and then you say you no know or yes or no. Okay. Since we have all this fire that's burnt off completely everything, we still have some of these in the barrel and we have a pile left over there by the other tree. So if you want to go ahead and bring them all here, the rest of them, completely all of them, and we'll stack and make more for fire. We're not going to do it tonight, but we'll do it like tomorrow night or 10. So let's bring it here. Yeah, right here. You can use this guy for this side. Yeah, make a bit, make a border, bro. These are nice and dry, bro. These can go inside already. Look. No need for. Uh, no need for. Um, Shenanigans. No, no, for um, for the borders. We have enough borders. Like, there you go. So bring the rest here, and we'll make a nice fire setup. You guys, I'm gonna check up on Noah. Status update on the fire, Thanksgiving fire, you guys. This guy's been working hard for the past hour. Look at this, he brought more wood. I'm just sitting here eating apples. Let's see, he made a second row here. Hey buddy, good job on the fire, bro. Thank you. So we're gonna, <laughs> I know it's so good I can't stop so we're gonna light it uh, I don't know if it rains tomorrow I don't know if it's gonna be okay to light it at night but Dude, if it rains, 
If it rains, it's gonna suck, man. This fire was so good, everything dried up. And we have some apples for the deer, look. Look at this. Woo! So, we're gonna feed the, de feed the deer. So, won't come apart it's like just yeah just put it put it on right on top and we'll oh. burn it there you go so we'll make this we'll top it off let's check the weather tomorrow let's check the weather here what does this weather say my location oh good it's gonna be oh some rain look some rain 4 a.m. Little rain at 4 a.m., but should be good. Thursday says 64, so it's gonna be pretty warm. So, yeah, Thursday 64. Yeah, you can just bend them, like, don't even have to break them. Just bend them, yeah, together like this. Yeah, there you go. Just figure out a way to bend it, yeah. Yeah, so that's Noah's creation, Noah's fire, look. Looks legit, guys. So Noah is done with uh, his fire. Right, Noah? Yes, sir. Shake the camera, yes. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. Yeah, fire's done, and I'm just working, uh, finishing up on Jeremiah's car, on Jeremiah's Lexus, so I'm going to send this piece. This is the extra um, potty that we had to put because of the uh, crease right here. And it has to be, you know, you can't have it open it has to be straight so I had to add more uh, two more coats of um, uh, icing to build up what was made you know the, the the dent we pulled it out but it was not enough so we had to build up because all the um, the door molding and everything has to be tight so the water doesn't get underneath so I'm just gonna go and sand it with this It still has a little bit right here. You can see that it's um, it's a little weird because it, it needs you need to add more and more. Like I'm gonna have to probably mix another batch and add more here. So so because it, it has to be flat. And this I only use this only to take off the the top layer and then I finish with the with the blocks because hand coordination you can't beat it. You know this you're gonna sand you don't feel it and then you sand it all the way. And it's gonna be basically taking it all off but here you have to make you know shape it with your hands so that's what's gonna happen here so I was able to smooth things over with this quarter panel and basically if you see what I'm talking about right here I'm gonna get this little piece right here this here so look at this quarter panel look it's all nice and smooth look now it's ready for primer. Yeah, you know, it's gonna be all white. Yeah, you're you're gonna get everything white. So not. You, that's why you don't touch. You just yes. film. Yeah, just be, make sure you don't touch it because this dust gets in everywhere. So I smoothed it out. That's it. Finished product, you guys. I masked this car. This Lex is here. This is all done. Masked, prepped for primer. Jeremiah is sanding his bumper right here, wet sanding, looks nice, started off good, just have to be patient, it takes a lot of patience on the bumpers like these, with a lot of details, it takes a lot. We also gonna primer this car here, which is the hood, little couple of dents on this one, then I have that primer is gonna go on this big part this is just the Tacoma it's a customer car okay I have my little mixing station here so this gun is a 1.3 I use it for sp spot painting like the jams and just fenders and stuff like that I can paint a car with it it's good enough but it's really cheap usually back in my painting days uh, 20 years ago a little over 20 years ago I used SATA which is still they still make uh, German uh, guns they're about a thousand bucks for a good gun, 1200 bucks. This is 80 bucks right here, so um, I don't need that right now. I have this one here for primer, 1.8 nozzle. So we'll use that. I got my mixing, got my mixing 
little uh, can. So, and the primer that we have is just gonna be this uh, Gentec right here. They said it was good, so um, I've been using that. Let's get some sticks right here. Open it up, mix it, and get this primer sp sprayed on those cars. So I mixed my primer right here. Look at this. Got my gun filled up. Now we're gonna go out and let's go outside. Look at this cat, bro. What's the cat doing? Just hanging out. Let's go spray. Let's go get the air. I don't even know where my air nozzle is. Everything set up here. Okay. Okay, got my air set up. Now we're spraying the quarter panel that we did here. We're gonna have a little overspray, but it's fine. Oh, you're smooth. Smooth criminal, bro. Okay, looks good. All right, let's move on to a different part. Okay, okay, we're doing another one right here. You guys, I done. I got done with the uh, primer. Put uh, a guide coat on. I put about three or four coats over here. Same with this. This door here. All the spots. The hood. Put a guide coat on it. Looks good. And that's it. And that's a wrap for today. Time to clean up. I made a little extra of primer, but we're just gonna dump it because usually I put fast activator in it. So, which is this stuff right here, Gentech fast activator, and it it'll dry up, up. Like if you put it in a can and even store it, it'll dry up. So within a half an hour, it'll be like jello. So you don't want to keep it. We're just dumping it, cleaning the gun. Gonna go prepare for Thanksgiving. Thank you for watching. Uh, God bless you and your family. Uh, go spend time together, eat turkey, be good, go to church if you have church. Thank you for watching. God bless.